Gotta take the good with the bad, smile with the sad, love what you got and remember what you had. Guys, we are back. Okay, I told y'all in the previous video when we defeated the Los Angeles Sparks, put the word back on the street, okay, that we are on top. Chicago Skyscrapers, we did it. You know, Angel Reese is down and out due to an injury. Okay, with some other players that got snapped up during this freaking game. It's crazy. I, I really wish all the Chicago Skyscraper ladies well and to protect them by the end of the season, or during the rest of the season, rather, from all injuries and illnesses. Again, guys, so we just defeated the Dallas Wings here at, no, I said here in Chicago. I don't live in Chicago, at least not yet. But again, like, we, we defeated them at our home uh, arena, Winfrey's Arena in Chicago. Let me kick you off the play-by-play. -play. The first quarter begins. Okay, Kennedy Carter scores. Okay, she gets his first point in the game. She was cooking up. Michaela makes two or two free throw shots. Saw two scores. Kennedy scores. Kennedy scores. Kennedy gets one of one free throw shots. Howard scores. Enrique makes a three. Allen scores. Saw two makes a three. Izzy scores. Kennedy makes a three. Enrique scores. Michaela makes a three. Allen scores. Izzy scores. Enrique scores. Camilla makes two or two. Dana makes a three. Okay, Dana and Diamond was actually getting busy. Izzy was a worthless tonight. My goodness. Enrique makes two or two free throw shots. Diamond scores. Camilla scores. Saw two scores. Kennedy makes one or two free throw shots. The first quarter ends with the Chicago Sky. We had 33 points, and the Wings only had 19 points. It was embarrassing. The second quarter begins. Saw two scores. Sheldon scores. Kennedy makes two or two free throw shots. Diamond scores. Saw two hits a three. Camilla scores. Sheldon scores. Kennedy scores. Dana scores. Dana makes yet another three. I was like, who is this woman? Enrique scores. Izzy scores again. Wings make one or two free throw shots. Izzy scores. Michaela makes one of two. Enrique scores. Enrique hits a three. And the second quarter ends with the Chicago Sky. We have 51 points. The Dallas Wings, 35 points. The third quarter kicks off. Wings score. Kennedy scores. Sheldon scores. Izzy scores. Izzy makes one of one free throw shots. Izzy scores again. Kennedy scores. Camilla scores. Wings makes two of two. Michaela makes zero of two. I was like, come on now, Michaela. Kalani, uh, Kalani Brown, that is. She makes one of two. Wings score. Kennedy scores. Kalani makes two of two. Kennedy makes two of two. McCowan scores. Satu makes zero of two of her free throw shots. I'm like, damn. Izzy scores. Kennedy scores. Uh, Diamond scores. Then Bree Turner scores. Howard scores. Michaela makes two of two. Uh, Cygress, I believe that's how you pronounce her name. Uh, she scores. Izzy scores. Then Howard scores. In the third quarter ends with the Chicago Sky. We had 78 points. The Wings only had 54 points. Fourth quarter kicks off. Enrique makes two of two free throw shots. Dana makes a three. McCowan scores. Diamond, unfortunately, she gets injured. Okay, her she was grabbing on her lower right leg. Again, like, you know, when she was coming up on a layup, she kind of got fouled. It kind of wasn't the other person's fault, but, you know, she gets uh, injured, carried off the court. She goes to the locker room. Angel Reese followed her, you know, make sure she was all right, but she did not enter back into the game. McCowan scores. Howard scores. Michaela scores. Enrique scores. Enrique makes one of one. Enrique scores again. Camilla scores. Howard scores. Howard scores again. Kennedy scores. McCowan scores. Kennedy hits a one of one free throw shots. Izzy makes two or two free throw shots. Kalani makes two or two free throw shots. And then the wing scores. Izzy scores, and that is game, ladies and gentlemen. As Chicago Skyscrapers, we came out with a W. We had 92 points. The Dallas Wings ended this game with only having 77 points. Again, this was an incredible game. It was an emotional game. Again, it's like, you know, Barbie and Ken. You know, what is Barbie without Ken, and what is Ken without Barbie? We, just lost, we had lost Kennedy for like three or four games due to illness with COVID. She finally comes back to us, the Chicago Skyscrapers, to show up and show out in our games. Then we lose Angel due to a wrist injury, okay? Well, I, think, I believe it's her left side. So we lose Angel. But again, she was there, you know, not in her jersey, but she was sitting courtside with her teammates and supporting to root on her teammates, you know, the Chicago Skyscrapers. So again, it's like, you know, just to see Diamond get snapped up. Uh, Brianna Turner, she was cooking up. Again, I was like, these women are playing like they really want that eighth, speed, eighth seed spot, right? Because again, Atlanta just lost to the Indiana Fever. So I believe we might have just clinched. Um, we may have just clinched it. But if not, I believe the next game right, will determine if Atlanta or Chicago are going to get it. But right now, it's like, again, we just we just won. And Chicago just, not Chicago, I'm sorry, Atlanta just lost the fever. So, again, like, we, we're getting, you know, we're we're getting better, okay? I'm sure that it was an emotional, you know, time for the teammates of the Chicago Sky, you know, to see that Angel was not uh, able to actually come into the game. But, again, like, they played phenomenal. I don't know if it's the Dallas Wings they suck that bad. But then, again, the Dallas Wings, they've been cooking up. They, they lost three games in a row after winning three games in a row. So, again, it's like they on and off. Like, they're very hot and cold. But, again, the Wings, like, we literally, like, at one point, I believe we almost had, like, a 30-point lead on them. I'm like, what is wrong with them? Yeah, Dana was making threes, hit, hitting threes. Uh, Diamond was getting busy. Izzy was actually not being worthless. She was actually playing defense, guys. I saw her blocking shots, stealing the ball, putting up layup, putting up layup. Speaking of layups, Kennedy Carter again, a.k.a. Kennedy Carter, who going to guard her, okay? 
she the way again like i wish she would like teach a master class to like angel reese again like not no tea no shade okay i don't know how to make them lay up the way like it'll be like three women right there she don't give a damn they'd be right in her face she just ah, 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 and just lay it up i'm like oh my god like again kennedy does not hesitate she just attacks that basket she don't care who in their way again like and who in her way again she's only stand, she stands at five foot nine angel at six foot three and she just ah, puts it in like with no problem Again, it was nice to see Kim Malkney, okay, uh, the, the the current head coach for the women's college basketball team at LSU. That's where not only Angel Reese used to play for when she was in college, but also Kalani Brown, Miss Kalani Brown of the Dallas Wings. Again, they are both the daughters, okay? Okay, okay, they were they were taught by one of the greatest uh, women's basketball coaches, which is Kim Malkney, okay? She showed up and flew all the way from Baton Rouge, Louisiana, to Chicago uh, tonight to see her players play. And unfortunately, of course, I'm sure it was just heartbreaking for her, of course, she wasn't able to see Angel Reese play because she's, because she's out for the rest of the season due to that wrist injury. But again, she wasn't able to see, you know, Kalani Brown. She was, you know, speaking with um, Angel Reese and speaking with Angel Reese's mom. I'm sure that she was giving them encouragement and support, and, you know, just making sure, like, you know, her mental health is okay as well as her physical health. So, again, shout out to Kim Malkney. She's an incredible, talented, amazing woman. Again, guys, it's looking good for us. I don't care what nobody says. See, my little prayer last night, maybe it appeared that it didn't work because I said, you know, I had us a little prayer circle. While I was in my video, so let's pray and wish healing upon injuries that she won't be able to sit out on Sunday's game. It turned out that she got to sit out for the rest of the season. But she said she will be back for Unrivaled in the 2025 season. So, hey, again, like she was actually there practicing with her teammates, warming up for the game with her right hand. She was putting up layups, okay? And I'm going to put up a picture of, um, you know, um, what's his name? I'm sorry. Kobe Bryant doing the same thing. He had like a right uh, wrist or, or lower forearm injury you can see him on practices shooting on his left hand again like the grind don't stop and i want you guys to see what you know injuries is going through and cameron brinks right that's another rookie who's who's been out this entire season she hasn't played since like june 13th it's just crazy right and it's like you know we got to see what these young women are going through and use that as inspiration like just because you know like what's that saying go you know how that saying goes i'm delayed but not denied okay just because something doesn't some things doesn't happen you know when we want it to right in a specific time zone time frame we might have to wait a little bit longer. It does not mean that we've been denied. We just got to wait a little bit more. Look at Cayman Brings. I'm sure, like, again, like, her story is amazing. She's an amazing and incredible basketball player for the Los Angeles Sparks. You know, she did, I believe, something like, I think she tore her ACL, right? Um, Kate Martin, she bruised her Achilles. You know, it's, it's happening to a lot of rookie, rookies, and it's heartbreaking to see them. You know, they literally, they, they just finally got into the, the big women leagues, like the big girl leagues. And when you see them getting hurt time and time again, they're getting injured, snapped up, they're getting ill, they're getting sick, and they have to either – sit out games and there are you know the complete season like angel reese and cameron brinks look at asia wilson today new york liberty they just beat the las vegas aces by four points and of course you know i believe that you know it's in my heart if asia wilson was in that game she would have made something shake like it wouldn't have went that way the way that it did but becky was like you know what and that again guys that's the first game tonight was the first game that asia wilson has set out for 208 games she hasn't set out one game since 2019 that's crazy and I know it hurt her. I know it pained her. It's that Becky probably had to fight her. And hey, listen, okay? She got a lower right uh, uh, leg injury as well. She probably had to say, Asia, no, we need you for Wednesday for the Indiana Fever game. We must sit you down, okay? And you're like, you know what? She had to do it again. Like that's that's really hard. I'm sure it's just it's just it's a mind, you know, f, you know, when it comes to these athletes, like such as Asia Wilson, who's so effective. She's a floor general. When you got to just sit down and watch your teammates just get obliterated because you're you know, ill or injured, I'm sure that it makes them feel weak. It makes them feel helpless. It makes them feel infuriated. Man, again, shout out to all my Chicago skyscrapers, Angel Reese, Kennedy Carter, um, Camilla Cardoso. She was cooking up. She got a double-double tonight. Um, Dana Evans, Diamond the Shields. Maybe y'all not so worthless. <laughs> I'm sorry. Izzy, a.k.a. Dizzy, okay? Tasha, Tasha Cloud must have been taught, teaching her girlfriend. If y'all don't know, you know now, Tasha Cloud of the Phoenix Mercury is dating uh, Isabel Harrison of the Chicago Sky, a.k.a. Izzy. Okay, she must have show, showed her some, some tips and tricks on how to cook up on the basketball court, okay? Again, I'm not sure if I, if I said her name. Shout out to Michaela again. Um, shout out to Brianna Turner. I think I saw Elizabeth Williams in this game, maybe. To me, Brianna Turner and Elizabeth Williams, well, I don't know why they, they look like to me. I'm, I'm tripping. Shout out to Lindsay Allen. Again, like, you know, just shout out to the entire Chicago skyscrapers. Again, like, we got about, what, five games left? We cannot be discouraged guys forget again like just draw inspiration from what these rookies are going through from whether it be illness or injury right remember delayed not denied we gonna get through this